Alrighty, so what we got here is an SG06 that was installed by others uh, sometime around, I'm going to say 2013, according to um, documentation that I can find on site. Uh, we have a number of issues. When I first walked in, uh, the relief valve was blowing, which on a steam boiler, that's a scary sight, let me tell you. Uh, so I shut it down immediately and um, went to check the pigtail, and the pigtail has been clogged and probably clogged from, from the beginning of its operation. And the reason why I suspect that is that uh, I found this, that somebody had uh, ripped off and probably changed the relief valve and then, when they installed another one, they did uh, they did the compression fitting, which was nice of them, and they put it on a T and so forth. So we're gonna we're gonna put in ours and stop that issue and take care of that. And they got a tiger loop on there, which is nice. Um, and I gotta point out where credit where credit is due the. Uh, the near boiler piping is not tea bag. I'll tell you that much right now. Um, there's the uh, Harford loop there where they've tied in, uh, all two inch, which is nice. Uh, nice uh, sized header. The takeoffs are, are in good uh, good order. All 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 pretty good. Uh, the issue here was that the VXT was. Uh, in the high 200s, and it was flashing, so that's not so good. Uh, we, we've had a severe water loss for a while, so you always suspect a zombie boiler. So when you open it up, uh, and this is what I found, um, pretty well suited up. Um, we've got, uh, you know, got. I saw the soot out there at first, and this is the clean out. So I knew that I had a problem. Um, it's funny, there's no soot down here. It's this sort of iron deposits. There's the uh, there's the head on there. Uh, we're adding a sight glass blow down. Of course, we cleared the uh, pigtail. Um, the um, Probe was definitely had, had formed a crust on the outside, which is definitely not uh, something we want to see. So we're gonna we're gonna be working. I also drain the boiler. Uh, we're gonna be changing out these uh, uh, drain valves, and uh, we've let it cool for a little bit. We're gonna swap them out and uh, work on the water side, and then we're gonna work on the fire side, and then we're gonna find out what's wrong with the rest of the system.